Hey guys, that's going to be back with today's video. So today we're going to talk about how to spot and cure turtle shell rot. Now the first thing we're going to talk about is how to spot it. If your turtle has any pink spots or white spots on it that are squishy and smell bad. Yeah, that, that I did say that fast. But anyways, squishy or smell bad, then your turtle does sadly have shell rot. So you're going to want to first of all correct why your turtle got the shell rot. That means that you did not have a proper basking dock or lights. So you're going to want to get that up and running. Now if your turtle did get shell rot and you do have that, it's probably because it's not basking enough. Which I'll leave some info down in the description of what you can do if it's not basking enough. So after you've got a new basking dock or you've got your basking dock, and you're going to do the treatment. You're going to take it out of water and you're just going to clean its shell off with a soft toothbrush. Any dirt or any algae just to like get it clean. Don't touch the, um, the white parts yet, like the, the actual shell rot. Next thing you're going to do is you, you can put it back in its tank or you can do this all in one day. You could like span it out so your turtle doesn't get stressed. But you want to dry it off as well as you can. And you're going to take little, like ointment or something like Vaseline or polysporin or like antiseptic like hydrogen peroxide. And you're just going to clean the white spots. This generally just kills off like all the, uh, the bacteria in it. So like that'll like pretty much end your shell rot. If it's mild, if it's very, very bad, you're probably going to have to take it to a vet as you can see. My turtle wants food. Okay, we're going off topic. Anyway, so yeah, just clean it off. After that, you're going to want to put it in just a little container like this right here for two hours. No water, up to two hours, because this just like allows the shell to get dry and allows the stuff really to go into the shell rot without being disturbed by the water. So that's pretty much it. After you're done that, everything should clear up. Uh, it might take a couple of months for the actual like spots to go away. After I think like two or three weeks, you're, you, it will just be easy to like brush it off with a toothbrush again. If it doesn't come off, then leave it, but it should just come off easily after two or three weeks. So yeah, if none of this works, then you're probably going to have to take it to the vet, but I don't know, maybe comment down below and I'll tell you some things you can do. But yeah, and if you want to do some of your own research, you can just search how to cure turtle shell rot and they'll give you some other things too. So yeah. If you follow these steps and have your proper basking dock and proper filtration, as you can see, you'll have a happy and healthy turtle. Bye, guys.